Welcome to r slash choosing beggars. We have some real treats for you today with some super entitled people expecting the best and offering the worst. And before we get into the video, I am willing to heart your comment for the low, low price of $10. All you have to do to earn that heart is to give me the best choosing beggar comment possible as to why you shouldn't have to spend $10 for it. Hello, I saw your ad on Craigslist about an Asus laptop. Is it still for sale? Hey, yes it is. Are you interested? Could you list me the PC specifications? Sure, here are the specifications. Do you think that could run games? It's a gaming laptop, so yeah, one could say it could run games. <laughs> are you making fun of me? Okay, do you take 300 for it? Oh, no, 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 sorry, that's too low for me. I bought the laptop last year for around $2,000. It's still in amazing condition. Plus, it's a good laptop, should still be relevant for some years. I'll make it 1,000 minimum, sorry. 400 please. No, like I said, that's too low for me. Okay, I don't have a thousand though. Well, I'm sorry. Hope you find a laptop that fits your budget. But I can pay in other way? It says in your ad it's pick up at address. I live 20 minutes away. What do you mean? You know, I could give you $400 and something else for the laptop. Okay, but what do you mean by something else? What I mean is that we could settle this business in bed. I promised my fiance I would get him an amazing gift for Valentine's, but I wasn't planning on spending that much. I remember he said he really wanted to buy an Asus ROG, so you got what I need and I got what you want. Oh my god, I can't believe this is happening. This is gold. Are you serious right now? Come on, just tell me if you want it or not. I can be there this evening and we'll both be happy. No, who the fuck said I wanted you? I want $1,000. Plus, it's not really a good gift if you're cheating just to get it. I mean, that makes no sense. You sound crazy. Your loss, hon. No, not my loss. It's funny because you're not only a choosing beggar, but also a cheating whore. Good luck on your pursuit for laptops and dick. God, I would give anything to hear the conversation between this woman and her fiance on Valentine's Day. Oh, babe, you got me a laptop. Awesome. How'd you buy this thing? Oh, no big deal. Just had to suck some guy's dick. Sweet, babe. Thanks. Looking for free kitten that comes with litter box, litter, and food and can be delivered to me in a dress. So, you want a cat without the responsibility of providing for the cat. Do us a favor and don't get a cat. Hi Blank, it's Blank from secondary school. I couldn't help noticing you are selling a car on Facebook. I have a question. Sure, what is it? Well, my boyfriend has just passed his test and I wanted to get him a car for Valentine's Day. I don't have a lot of money, so I was wondering if you could just give it to me. What? It's on for 1,500 pounds. That is, by the way, underpriced. It has a board engine, turbo, and bucket seats, all worth a lot more than that alone. It is just some old Russian car anyway. You're not going to sell it. Besides, I was one of your close friends in school. Remember when Blank was bullying you for your accent and I stuck up for you? Please, we are poor. We both work at supermarkets. Please, I will give you an PS3. So what if you stuck up for me? It's not even my car. I'm selling it for my friend after he had to move back home. The only reason it's so cheap is so it will shift fast. The lowest I'm allowed to go is 1,000 pounds. That's it. Also, if you can't afford to buy it, you couldn't run it. It's heavily modified so it will shoot up insurance, especially if he has just passed. It's also from the late 80s, so it's not very fuel efficient. I am sorry, but you may need to go for a normal little hatchback, not a track-ready drift build. OMG, I hope you get deported, you Russian slut. Just give me the fucking car. It's not like either of you need it. You already have a car. How can you been so selfish? I still remember when you were too poor to buy lunch. Shaking my head, you should understand the struggle. I was going to recommend a friend's car that is only 500 pounds. But since you want to see me deported, I guess I won't help you. No, I'm sorry. I'm a little drunk. Please help me. We need a car. God damn it, Blink. I need a car. Fuck you, Russian cow. I hope you crash. I can't wait till Brexit so we can ban you Russians. Okay, I don't care. Tell your boyfriend to enjoy walking. I honestly don't see the problem with the situation. I was nice to you once in school. Therefore, give me your car. Seems reasonable to me. Hi, is this phone still available? If so, I would like to purchase it. Yes, it's still available. Where are you located? I am in Arlington. Is the price negotiable though? 
okay, can you meet me at blank? And no, the price is non-negotiable. You're getting an iPhone 8, 256 gigabytes for $280. I believe that's a fair price. You won't reconsider? I am a broke college student and really, and I really need this phone. I am sure I can find this phone cheaper elsewhere, so you are not being very fair. Then go buy it elsewhere. Let's do a deal between us. I will send you nudes every day for a month, and I will even send you a few videos every week if you sell it for me for $100. You know my nudes sell for a lot nowadays. Let me know. The frick? No, dude, I'm just trying to sell a damn phone for 280 cash. I don't want your nudes. If you don't have cash to purchase the phone, then I am sorry, but I will have to sell the phone to someone else. That's not fair. I already told you. I am a broke college student. I need this phone to do my homework. You seem young too, so I'm sure you would understand. I only have 100. Take it or leave it. Lol boy, bye. You are a very selfish person. You don't even need this phone. $280 is probably nothing for you. Might as well sell it for me for 100 and get a few nudes from a hot guy. Dude, I told you no. My price is firm. Please stop contacting me. You will never see a guy like me naked. Your loss. God, I hope I never do. You know, money is not everything in this life. Money doesn't buy happiness. I have to wonder, if this guy's nudes sell for so much nowadays, why doesn't he just sell some of his nudes, get some cash, and then buy a new phone? Hi, I'm Blank. I saw your post on Twitter of Blank Hair, and it's really pretty. How much is it to do something similar for me? Hey, it costs 120 pounds. That includes the cost of my trip to your place. That's pretty much. Can I pay 50 pounds though? No, 50 pounds is too low. I can do it for 100 pounds though just because Blank referred you and she says you're one of her friends. Can I pay 55 pounds? I'll tag you on Instagram and I have over 10k followers so you'll get great exposure. Still no, 100 pounds is as low as I'll go unfortunately. But Blank said you did her hair for free. I'm just asking for a discount. Why are you being such a bitch? All you're doing is making the hair. LMAO, um, Blank is my sister and she does my nails for free so I don't charge her either. Also, this is literally the cheapest you'll find someone making hair around here so take it or leave it. Come on, I've got tons of followers and you should be doing it free because I'll bring you a lot of clients but I'm giving you 55 pounds, be grateful and accept it. Hard pass, mate. Okay, fine, I'm gonna do this instead. Should be like 45 pounds, yeah? <laughs> Girl, first of all, this is way more complex than Blank's hair and you're offering less? The absolute least I would do for this hair is 150 pounds. And to be honest, I wouldn't do it for that price for you because I don't like your tone. Oh, F off you dumb C. I was only trying to help you out because you look broke anyway. I shouldn't even be paying anything because I'm really popular and so many people would love to do my hair. The braids were absolute trash anyway. I just wanted something cheap to carry for a bit. Lol, okay. Keep that same energy when I see you at Blank Birthday Party on Saturday. Hey, sorry about yesterday. I was having a bad day and I took it out on you. Hello? It's fine. Can you still do the hair? For 150 pounds, I can. How about for 60 pounds? For 60 pounds, I cannot. Oh, come on. 60 pounds is great. I'm not being cheap or anything, but it's a great deal for you. I'll recommend you to all my friends if you do it. Actually, you should totally be paying me for the PR I'm going to give you. You did not just ask me to take a one hour train to blink, do your hair for eight hours, take another hour train back and do all of this for less than minimum wage, plus pay you for PR? Do you actually hear yourself think? Would you charge Kim Kardashian 150 pounds? Huh? If you were going to do Kim's hair knowing how much exposure she could give you, would you charge her 150 pounds too? Bitch, are you Kim Kardashian? Well, you just lost a whole lot of customers that I would have brought if you made my hair. I defo don't want any cheap ass customers you'd have brought me so I basically just dodged a bullet. Don't text me again. Stingy effing C, you're already making enough money. It's not like you effing spend it on yourself considering how you dress. I'm just asking for a little effing discount but you're too entitled to give it. I hope someone does this to you when you're broke. Speaking of exposure, please subscribe to my channel. If you subscribe to me, I will tell all of my friends that you are my subscriber. Think of all the incredible exposure you will get when I tell my friends how awesome of a person you are. Selling 2005 Dodge Dakota for $6,500. Will you take $4,500 today if I like it? $4,000 tomorrow? 
Sorry, we are firm on 6,500. All right, 4,000, I'll give you till noon. Okay, repriced just for you, new deal, $7,000. I like how this guy made his cheapness vaguely threatening. $4,000, I'll give you till noon. That is today's r slash choosing beggars video. And remember, I am selling hearts on YouTube comments for $10. Embrace your inner choosing beggar and write a comment down below as to why you don't deserve to pay $10. And the heart will go to the best choosing beggars among you. Good luck.